three, four. So here five, we are. Opposing force, and one, this is my two, second three, let's play. Four, so, five. if you've uh, been following my series, I did blue shift before this. I'm actually doing it in reverse order. Oh, you've woken up. Just Corporal to keep it a bit Shepherd, more different. Is it? I've read the text. Uh, yes, here we are, opposing force. I'm glad to see my life saving efforts weren't in vain. I can't say the same for him. I'm afraid you have been through a serious accident. Most of your friends didn't make it. I was hoping that you soldiers had come to rescue us, but now it seems we are all in the same situation. I think I saw a radio near the crash site where I found you. Perhaps you can go there and radio for help? Okay, we will then. After I get my equipment. So, um, we are playing as Corporal Shepherd, and you can see that we're, we're at a different angle from Half-Life and Blue Shift. We're playing from the side of the soldiers, and not from the scientists or security guards. And you can also see the first mutation of a soldier there, from a head crab. And a very oh! worried looking scientist. <laughs> oh. And we won't be going near him. So yes, we have now got our all our equipment on, this dead scientist you and the dead zombie. All about you. So my reputation precedes me. Hmm. Okay, Shepard, I see you found your power vest. That should keep you safe out there. See, now I've heard rumors that you troops may not actually be here to rescue us. Just don't forget about us out there. Alrighty? Okay, I'll let you through now. Hmm, come on. I gotta say, that mall security job is looking pretty good right now. Good luck, sir. So this is uh, the wrench, which you don't get in the other two games. You don't get the wrench, I don't think. Uh, so it's a bit of a, a special weapon for opposing force. And it looks like here we've got to remove the lasers. Which we did fairly effectively there. G-Man again there. Probably the closest you'll ever get to him, actually. At this point. And he's always in an inaccessible room. It's just the way it is. Couldn't take much to break these boxes up. It's like Minecraft. I always have to save a lot around here because of uh, issues I have with falling down these deep drops. That's probably because I have a faulty spacebar when it comes to playing these games. Spacebar is fine the rest of the time, just when I play games. And we've now picked up our knife. Oh, and of course, yeah, we haven't got a torch, we've got our night vision goggles in this game, which is different. Die, headcrab. Slice. Now, if we go too close there, he's going to come and grab the door. I was going to do it anyway. Don't grab the door. I'm grab it. Oh, oh, but this is 
uh, waiting game. That got close. Can't touch anything. It's all electric. So we can get this thing switched off. Simply like that. And now we can grab the door where he couldn't. I'm gonna keep the gun ready because I remember there are a few aliens around here. It wasn't long since I played this game. So it's not quite as blind as the other two which I was doing. Although I have played them all in the past. So we can see what we can find around here. A few goodies. Not much in them though. Uh, looks like we're going down again. With the broken ladder. What is this? Is this the way? Oh yeah, I think it is the way. It wasn't it wasn't long at all, and I've even forgotten where to go. Well, not so much where to go, but <laughs> what everything is. That's not good. Oh dear. How could I possibly manage to fall down? Five inch gap. Actually, it looks like it's blown out on purpose. Because you're going to avoid the steam, so you're going to fall down there. If anyone's going to do it, it's me. Oh no. Oh. It's a long way up that one. Right. Uh, where are we? Uh, do, 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 do soldiers equipment storage crates here. Uh, love that. Oh, aliens maybe. Yep. Aliens. No. Oh. Always, always with Half Life, you're gonna bring a lift down, and it's gonna have aliens on it. It's just the way it is. The exploding room. I remember this very well. Come on, explode. Explode. Oh. Save Getting a bit close. And now all the toxic waste is filling the room. And we don't have long. Uh, where do we go? Where do we go? Personnel only. A G Man again. He knew that this was going to happen. And he's going to save the day. And I bet when I run around here, he's not going to be there. Look at that, oh, you see, he's very secretive. How could he have possibly gone that quick? Right, now we've got the task of trying to jump the toxic waste. Hmm, might need that. Do we need it? Nah. I'll just jump it, if I can, save. I can. Head crabs. World's biggest pain. More head crabs. More head crabs. And another one. Hmm, so. Oh, we've got this 
conveyor thing. Just lift. Uh, with an explosive on it, which I'm guessing needs to be shot. Um, I think that's it. We now have to try and cross here. Actually, we don't need that. Uh, nothing in it anyway. Another head crab there. And this is the tricky part, we need to jump across to open the door, then jump back, and then jump back here to jump through the door. Hmm. Worth loading on that, I think. Like I said, I've got a problem with my jump. Oh, it still hurt me. Uh, I'll save. Load. Come on. Save. Jump. Oh, that'll do. Open. And jump. Yep. We're okay. Uh, jump. Now we're going to jump through the door. Save. And we've done it. That's how you do that bit. Uh, I remember that bit very well. Uh, now I don't remember any of this, so... We'll just... <laughs> Carry on with caution. Normally, when he goes all quiet, like it's just a, an alien or something about to appear. Oh! Gotta check for underground minces. No minces here. Um, it's all too quiet. You'd normally have a bull squid or something down here, I guess the water's too deep. Uh, but I fear the next alien is not too far off, probably a vortigon. Oh! Or barnacles. Grenades, they'll always come in handy. Although we are soldiers this time, normally I throw them four soldiers, I throw them at soldiers. So, uh, Oh, it's stuck. Uh, go free with your crate. Oh, I freed you. I'm surprised that thing couldn't. I must have some auto detection things so stop from moving when something in the way. But it should be able to put its crate down and move it somehow. It's uh, this is a science lab after all. Well, science area. Science facilities. It's conveniently putting up there. So I can jump on it, no doubt. Um, I'm guessing when it's gone this way. Yep, save. And does it empty it? Will it empty? Will it empty? Are you going down? Go down. It is going down. And it reveals a. Ooh, ooh I don't know. Car park, load tarmac. Is there anything through there as well? Where does it go? Theoretically, this lift should not really work as it's been sitting in all that toxic waste. But this is half life, everything works. But actually, no, not a lot work. Oh, glad they work. Could have been squeezed to death. Oh, what are these? No. Just about enough bullets. Um, so yeah, this looks like the transit system mainly with the trams. It is the transit system with the trams, and it looks like this has been put here nicely for us to jump on the tram. Oh, don't be going off the edge with it. Close enough? No. That looks like it's close enough, is it? Yeah, that'll do. Jump. There we go. Okay, so now what? Where it's going, is it? The tram is going to move. 